Post intubation, hypotension can definitely come from the medications that are used. You're not going to use the doses that you typically use when a patient is hemodynamically stable, like if you were going to intubate the person in the OR for an elective case. But don't forget that there are other things that play into this. What's the person's volume status? Are they depleted because they are having hypovolemic shock? And also don't forget that the act of positive pressure ventilation, whether you're bagging the patient or putting them on the ventilator, is going to decrease venous return. And that decrease in venous return is also going to cause hypotension. So it's a multifactorial effect and medications is just one piece of that complex puzzle.